hello guys how are y'all doing hope y'all have been good all right so in today's video i'm gonna be sharing my thoughts on rema's music rema's music has always been one to catch the ears and easily make you get addicted there's no doubt that it makes good music you know guys from to maybe soundgasm calm down and now with his debut album he recently just released rave and roses for his first album he really did a good job so guys it's a 16 track album called raven roses and i've listened to some of the tracks on the album and they are all music worthy from time and affection with chris brown to divine divine is a really touchy feely storytelling kind of song and it narrated the story well and the song was totally amazing i've also listened to old me with slack and the one rema did with aj tracy called FYN which means fresh young nigga. I really like the sound of the track. I appreciate Rema's afro rave you know still afro beat and all but with a kind of different taste if you know what I mean. I'm sure y'all ravers have listened to all the tracks on the album already however drop your thoughts on the album in the comment section below. I want to know if y'all found the album interesting and worth it like I do even though I haven't listened to all the tracks on it yet only a few. So guys, it is established that the kind of song Rema makes is totally amazing and worth it, you know, it's Afro Rave and all. But I feel there is more that can be done from Rema. He shouldn't restrict himself only to singing Afro beat and rave. Uh, what about pop, R&B, well even if that's not his style, what about the style we all know he likes, you know, trapping. Rema was discovered with his trap kind of songs from his freestyle on Gucci Gang to his trap kind of tracks on YouTube like Trap Out, The Submarine, Spaceship Just Lane, Aliens, Spider-Man and the likes. For those of you that don't know the kind of music I'm talking about, watch this video, Rema's freestyle, Trap Out, The Submarine. I'll be playing you guys the video now. Yeah, take on my shoes, feel no work on butter, so how can I be wrong for this? Yeah, government, they be busy acting crazy, they shedding so much blood for this. They be calling my phone, tell me what all of them bitches they want for me. Yeah, so many niggas died, I did out, I told them I was born for this. Yeah, man, I believe in me, I am a prophecy. I trap out the submarine, I'm taking a walk on my CCP. She said she be missing me, your baby, your love is a misery. She said she be missing me, your baby, your love is a misery. I look at the cavalry, remember I got immortality. Trappers is not to read, they hitting and trying to murder me. Mm, yeah, can you smile on my mind? You're my slime, please don't cry. Take off my shoes, feel no work on buddy, so how can I be wrong for this? Hey, government, they be busy, act crazy, be shedding so much blood for this. Call on my phone, tell me what all of them bitches get one for me. Yeah, so many niggas die, how did I? Die. I told them I was born for this. Yeah. So guys, now that you've watched that and you know the kind of music I'm talking about, as Rema is focusing on Afro beats and his Afro rave, why isn't he putting in the same effort into trap music? He does really well with it, I personally enjoy them and I think his sound is nice too. For those of you who have listened to Rema's trap sound, don't you think you should embrace it more? Why is it that our Nigerian singers are only focusing on the Afrobeat genre? Accepted, it, it's our style, but are we restricted to only that genre and shouldn't we embrace other genres, pop, R&B, electronic, I mean, there should be creative freedom. I also think why Rema doesn't focus on his trap music is because of his label, Mavens. Mavens might not see the market strategy in it. The general public, as in Nigeria, will find it a tad difficult to accept that kind of music which might affect the marketing of the song and results to making less money. That's what I think guys, Nigeria seems to be their major market and they openly accept Afrobeats than they do trap music. However guys, these are simply my thoughts and drop what you think about them in the comment section below, I would love to see them. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Subscribe if you like my content. Wink.